Hi, thanks for joining us. Today I'd like to introduce you to our cable modem product portfolio, the Surfboard cable modem lineup. We have three products that we're going to show you today, the SB6121, the SB6141, and the SB6183. You'll notice both the Motorola and Aris logo on our products and also on our retail packaging. Aris acquired Motorola's home division last year to deliver the best, fastest, and most reliable products connecting you to the internet. The SB6121, our entry-level modem, is a DOCSIS 3.0 modem. It delivers speeds up to 172 megabits per second. How does it do that? It is a 4x4 channel bonded cable modem, meaning it literally takes four downstream channels and four upstream channels, combines them together, and enables you to get speeds up to 172 megabits per second. The SB6141 doubles the speeds of the SB6121. SB stands for surfboard and it is capable of 343 megabits per second, and it's an eight by four channel bonded cable modem. So it literally takes eight downstream channels, bonds them together, provides you that speed that you're looking for up to 343 megabits per second. The SB6183, it's capable of speeds up to 686 megabits per second, is a 16 by four channel bonded cable modem. It has 16 downstream channels and four upstream channels. All three of these cable modems are considered DOCSIS 3.0. DOCSIS is an acronym that shortens a specification that all of the cable operators have adopted that allows you to buy a product in retail and activate it on a cable operator's network. Connecting all three of these devices to the internet is rather simple. Depending upon your cable operator's configuration, process. You may have to call them and provide them with a serial number or a customer serial number that's located on the quick start guide included in your box. For our purposes today, we will just show a direct connection already established with our cable operator. And to do that, I'm just going to connect my coax cable to the unit, connect my power cord, and last but not least, I would connect my ethernet cable that can then be connected to a wireless router or directly to a computer. As you can see, the unit is going through the process of acquiring a signal. The first light indicates power. The second light indicates the downstream channel. Third light indicates the upstream channel. And the fourth light indicates internet connectivity. As you can see, both of these lights turn to blue indicating that you're in DOCSIS 3.0 mode versus DOCSIS 2.0 mode. Now, that is something that is dependent upon your cable operator and what they offer. This device, of course, is capable of 16 downstream channels and four upstream channels. So in our scenario, it is in DOCSIS 3.0 mode, providing you with the optimum speeds available. For additional information, please visit our website. And thank you for joining us.